जय राधा माधव कुंभ बिहारी शोदानंदन ब्रजन रंजन जशोदानंदन ब्रजन रंजन जमुना तीर बन चौधी So, my dear sons and daughters, I am so much obliged to you that you have become so enthusiastic for offering best puja. Now try to understand, several times you have explained why this function is called best puja. I have already explained in the morning, this offering, worshipping, one may think that this man is teaching his disciple man worshipping, anthropomorphism. But it is not man worshipping. One should not misunderstand. Vasudev 
is the original spiritual master. Original spiritual master is Krishna. From Krishna, Brahma was initiated, Lord Brahma. Tene Brahma Rida Adika Vay Muyantija Suraya. It is stated in the Srimad Bhagavatam that when Brahma was created, it was all darkness within the universe. He could not understand what is the purpose of his becoming there. Then he engaged himself in tapasya, and he was initiated from within. Krishna uh, is within everyone. Ishara sarvabhūtānāṁ riddhesa arjuna tiṣṭhati. So he is called Chaitya Guru, means Guru within the heart. And when Krishna understands, because Krishna knows everything, whatever we are willing, whatever we are doing, He is the Paramātmā, is sitting within our hearts as witness. Anuvantā upadrashtā. Upadrashtā means simply observing what we are doing and what we are desiring. So as we desire, Krishna is very kind. He gives us facility. We have many times explained. Therefore we have got varieties of body to enjoy this material world. So when Krishna sees, when Krishna sees that a living entity is very anxious, to understand Him or to revive His Krishna consciousness, then Krishna gives Him all opportunity, especially by manifesting Himself as the spiritual master. Antarbhahi. The spiritual master is therefore Krishna's manifestation, Krishna's mercy manifestation to help a person to develop his Krishna consciousness. From within he is helping. Therefore he is called Chaitya Guru. And from without he sends his representative to help how to become advanced in Krishna consciousness. Therefore to advance in Krishna consciousness we require two kinds of help. One from Krishna and another from the spiritual master. It is stated in the Chaitanya Charita Amrita. He'll be glad now that Chaitanya Charita Amrita is now published. Yes. This is the our Panditji Pradhamna. He has presented. Actually, he has worked for it. Although I have translated, but I am very much indebted to him that he very carefully edits and makes the thing very perfect. So now we have got translation of Srimad Bhagavatam, Bhagavad Gita, and Sanskrit portion, because mostly there is Sanskrit portion. So, so my beloved disciple, Pradhamna, I call him Pandit Mahasaya because he is actually doing the Pandit's work. So he edits and he works very hard. But not only that, his wife is also helps in this connection. So actually, that is one. Kiba vipra kiba sudra nasi kane no. Jai Krishna tattva vitta sai guru. I am sometimes criticized by my God-brothers, that I have become a marriage-maker, because a sannyasi does not take part in a marriage ceremony, but I get my disciples married. This is also unique in the history. So they criticize me that I have become a marriage-maker. 
but they, they do not know why I take this risk. I have got many disciples, they are married couples, but all of them, husband and wife, they are helping this movement. Here is Bhagavan Das, he is also married man, children. So actually married couple should be paramahamsa. Paramahamsa means the topmost stage of sannyas. Paramahamsa. Sannyasi has got four stages. Kutichak, Bahudak, Paribrajaka Acharya, and Paramahamsa. A sannyasi, in the beginning, he is supposed to make a small cottage just on the border of the village, does not go home, but the, his necessities are supplied by his home, but he does not go home. This is called kuticha. Then gradually when he is practiced, he begs from home to home. He does not anymore depend on his own home. That is called bahudak. Bahudak means collecting his necessity from many places. And then as he becomes practice, he becomes paribrajakāchāt. He goes from place to place, village to village, preaching the message of Krishna. As our uh, Sriman Devati Nandan Maharaj is doing, he has now very nice bus. All others also doing. The Girihastas are also doing. Because our only business is Krishna. It doesn't matter whether a Girihastha or Manaprastha or Sannyas. It doesn't matter. So when he preaches all over the world, and that is called Paribrajaka Acharya. And when he is experienced, he executes the word by his assistant, that is called paramahamsa. So grihasthas are supposed to be paramahamsa. Just like Bhaktivinoda Thakur, he was grihastha, magistrate, government servant. But he has worked so much for Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu in writing books, not only writing books, but also begetting a child like Bhaktisiddhanta Saraswati Goswami Maharaj, my spiritual master. So that is Grihastha. They should produce children like Bhaktisiddhanta Saraswati Goswami Maharaj, because we want big stalwart men to preach this Krishna consciousness movement. So everyone has got duty in Krishna consciousness, and this duty is taught by Krishna and the spiritual master. Guru Krishna Kripa Pai Bhakti Lata B. Eirupe Brahmana Bhamite Kuno Bhagavan Ji. That anyone who is coming to Krishna consciousness is not ordinarily living being. Anyone who is connected with our movement is not ordinary living being. Actually, he is liberated soul. I am very much hopeful that my disciples who are now participating in today, even if I die, my movements will not stop. I am very much hopeful. Yes. All these nice boys and girls who have taken so seriously, Bhaktivinoda Thakur wanted that European and American people may understand the philosophy of Chaitanya cult and take part in it. That was his desire. My Guru Maharaj, ah, His Divine Grace, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Prabhupada, he also attempted to send his disciples to preach Chaitanya cult in the Western world. One of them, he advised me also, first meeting, perhaps you know, 
He asked me to preach. So at that time I was a young man, only twenty-five years old, and I was also householder. So I should have joined and executed his desire immediately. But uh, due to my ill luck, I could not immediately execute his order. But it was in my heart that it is to be done. So better late than never, I executed his order at the age of seventy years, <laughs> not at the age of twenty-five years. So actually I wasted so much time. I can understand that. The message was there when I was twenty-five years old, but I began at the age of seventy years, but I did not forget the message. Otherwise how could I do? That, was, that is a fact. I was simply finding out the opportunity how to do it. So anyway, although I began very late at the age of seventy years, so by the help of my disciples, this movement is gaining ground and is spreading all over the world. So therefore I have to thank you. It is all due to you. It is not my credit, but it is your credit that you are helping me in executing the order of my Guru Maharaj. So this movement, Krishna consciousness movement, that you already know that it is the most essential, most important movement to the human society. Last night, the ambassador of India, His Excellency Rasagotra, he was present here. He also appreciated that this movement is very important movement, and he was very pleased that I have done so much. So this movement will go on. Nobody can stop. So this vast puja ceremony means to offer our thanks to the Supreme Personality of Godhead, because He is the original Guru. As we receive this message through parampara system, from Krishna to Brahmā, Brahmā to Nārada, Nārada to Vāsudev, Vāsudev to Madhācārya, in this way Madhavendra Puri, then Ishwar Puri, then Chaitanya Mahāprabhu, then six Goswamis, then others, Bhaktivinoda Thakur, Jagannath Das Bhaji, Gaur Krishnath Das Bhaji Maharaj, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati, then we have taken. So this, as we have come to this Krishna consciousness understanding through this long parampara, similarly in the Bhas Puja ceremony, whatever respect, honor, and presentation you give, that goes to Krishna through that parampara system, from down, as it is received through the parampara system. So similarly your offerings also goes through this parampara system to the Supreme, the connection. Our system is gopi bhattu pado kamalayo dasa dasanu dasa. It is sometimes called bureaucracy. If you apply something, at least in India, to the president, you will have to submit to the local collector. The collector will submit to somebody else, somebody else, then secretary will go, then to the president. So our system is that. So it is not that I am training my disciples to worship me, man worship and getting some honor from them uh, for nothing. No, it is not that. Whatever honor, whatever respect, whatever presentation you are giving to your spiritual master, it will go to Krishna by parampara system. This is Vāśpūja. Therefore it is called Vāśpūja. Vāśpūja means 
Vyasadeva is the original guru after Brahma, Narod, then Vyas. And Vyas is original guru because from his literature we understand spiritual knowledge. All these literatures, whatever we have produced, they are actually originally from Vyasadeva. The four Vedas, Brahma Sutra, Unishad, Puranas, they are called Vedic literature. And whatever is written with the conclusion of this Vedic literature, that is also Vedic literature. Just like our books, all our books, they are not mental speculation. Whatever I have learned from my Guru Maharaj, I am presenting. That's all. It is not mental speculation. This philosophy, that philosophy, we kick out all this. Unless we get the knowledge from the authorized source, we don't accept. Because how we can accept? A so-called philosopher, scientist, according to... Why according? Everyone can understand that however great philosopher, scientist one may be, he is imperfect. He is imperfect. Every man, I have several times recited this example, that in our country Gandhi was very big politician, you know Mahatma Gandhi. He committed so many mistakes. At last he committed such a great mistake that he was killed. That's a long history. So even a great person like Mahatma Gandhi, he commits mistake. Therefore the śāstra says any conditioned soul, he must commit mistake, however great he may be, in the estimation of fools and laskars, sabai vidvaraha ustra. He must commit mistake, he must be illusioned, his propensity is to cheat and at the end, all the senses are imperfect. We have several times described. So, so much imperfectness, how we can give perfect knowledge? Therefore, a so called philosopher, scientist knowledge is always imperfect. Perfect knowledge can be received through these parampara system. From Krishna, Krishna to Brahma, Brahma to Narada, Narada to Vyas, Vyas to Madhacharya, in this way, from Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, six Goswamis, then our Guru Maharaj, in this way. And our business is just to present whatever we have heard. This is very important point. And because we do not speculate mentally, just like so many Samis come from India. They make their own presentation by speculation. So whatever little success I have got, it is due to this process that I do not present anything which is created by Me. That is the secret of success. All these rascals, I say, declaring this, all these rascals come, they manufacture. A spiritual thing cannot be manufactured, as God cannot be manufactured. God is always God, and the words of God is also God. If we present as it is, then it will be effective. That is to say in this āstra. Satāṁ prasaṅgāt mama bīja saṅvida bhavanti ritkannara sāyana katha tad jūsanāt āsū apavarka vatmani Sadhyavakti rati ranukramishyati. Everything is there. Sadam prasanga, from a bona fide spiritual master, you receive knowledge because he will present as he has received from his spiritual master. He will not adulterate or manufacture something. That is the bona fide spiritual master. And that is very easy. To become a spiritual master is not a very difficult thing. You will have to become a spiritual master. You, all my disciples, everyone should become a spiritual master. It is not difficult. 
it is difficult when you manufacture something. But if you simply present whatever you have heard from your spiritual master, it is very easy. If you want to become over-intelligent, to present something, to interpret something, you have heard from a spiritual master, you can make some further addition, alteration, then you will spoil the whole thing. Then you will spoil the whole thing. Don't make addition and alteration. Simply present as it is. Therefore we have begun in Bhagavad-gītā, as it is. Don't try to become over-spiritual master. Then you will spoil. Remain always a servant of your spiritual master and present the thing as your heart, you will be spiritual master. This is secret. You should know it. Don't try to become over intelligent. That will spoil. Evang parampara pratam imang raja sayogidu. So Chaitanya Mahaprabhu says, Amara gai guru haiya taro yai desh jare dakho tare kaho Krishna upadesh. That's it. It is very nice. You'll find in Chaitanya Chaitanya Amrita, now it is published. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu says, He is the Supreme Lord, Krishna. He says, Amaragya, whatever I say, Amaragya, by my order, you become a spiritual master. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. So, one may be very illiterate, no education, no scholarship, may not be born in Brahman family, or may not be a sannyasi. There are so many qualifications, but one may not have all these qualifications. He may be rascal number one, but still he can become a spiritual master. How? Amaragya. As Krishna says, as Chaitanya Mahaprabhu says, if you follow, then you become spiritual. One may be rascal number one from material estimation, but if he simply, strictly follows whatever is said by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu or his representative spiritual master, then he becomes a guru. So it is not very difficult. One may not think that I am not qualified to become guru. No, you are qualified if you follow strictly the parampara system, then you are qualified. That's all. Amaragya guru hai. And what is the difficulty? Chaitanya Mahaprabhu says, don't feel any difficulty, because as spiritual master, what you have to do? Jare dakho tare kaho Krishna upadesh. Whomever you meet, you simply speak to him the instruction which Krishna gives. What Krishna can instruction gave? And that is also very easy. What is that? Krishna says, Malmana bhava mad bhakta mad jaji maganamaskuru. Krishna says, just become my devotee, always think of me, offer me obeisances, and worship me. So here is Krishna. If you Simply think here is Krishna Radha, Krishna Diti. He may be full number, rascal number one. That doesn't matter. But you are getting impression of this Radha Krishna. Think of it. Oh, how nicely Krishna is decorated. This much. No erudite scholarship. Simply Krishna says, Manmana Bhava Madhav. Here is Diti. Worship him nicely as it is regulated principle. Even if you are not worshipping, simply think of Krishna. Here is Radha Krishna. Impression. So what is the difficult? As soon as you see Radha Krishna, you get some impression. Think of that impression. What is the difficult? Manmana bhava madhvakta. Worship me. If you have got opportunity, worship. If you are initiated, you are severe, or you install deity at home, as our Kirodop Sai Prabhu is doing, everyone can do it. What is the difficult? Now ask him how he is happy. The whole family is happy, not only he. 
but his wife, his children, everyone is happy. Practical. Manmana bhava madhu bhakta, madhu jaji, maganamaskuru. And if you cannot do anything, simply come and offer your obeisances. My dear Lord Krishna, I am so poor, so unfortunate, I cannot do all these things, but I offer my humble obeisances unto your Lord. That much also. If you do this, you become spiritual master. So simply by accepting this principle, and even if you are not learned, illiterate, you are hearing so much from Bhagavad Gita, you simply repeat that. Simply repeat that. There is no question of becoming very learned scholar. God has given you this ear. Even if you are blind, you cannot read. You can hear. So Krishna Upadesh. What is Krishna? This is Krishna Upadesh. And at last Krishna says, Sarvadarman Paritvajya Mami Kang Saranavat. So if you simply preach this cult, my dear friend, my dear brother, you surrender to Krishna, you become spiritual. You become spiritual master. You go door to door. No other talks. Simply say, my dear friend, you are very nice. You are very learned. That was adopted by Prabhupada Saraswati. Dante nidhaya tinakam padayo nipatya kakusatam kritvacha ahama bhurvimi. He is hadhava sagalame vabhihaya dura. Chaitanya chandra charane kurutanurāga. The meaning is, the preaching, it's very easy. Dante nidhāyatinaka, according to Indian system, if you put a grass on your mouth, it is a sign of that you have become very humble. If you approach a person with a grass in your mouth, he will immediately know you are coming there with very, very great humbleness. Therefore, dante nidhaya. This was the system. Dante nidhaya tunaka and touching his feet. Immediately touch his feet. Immediately, even if he is enemy, he will be your friend. Even if he is your enemy. It is so nice process. Take a grass on your mouth and immediately fall on his feet. Padaya nipatta. And with folded hands, much flattering, dante nidhāyatinakaṁ padayo nipatta kākuṣataṁ kṛtyācā, all flattering words, ahaṁ bravi. So immediately he'll agree, yes, what you say I'll hear. I'll hear. Immediately convert to hear you at least. Just, just see how perfect process is. Then what is your purpose, sir? Why you are becoming so humble, me? And now say, but yes, sir, I will say. What is that? He is sadhava. You are a great sadh. Although he is may, maybe rascal number one, still you call him. He is sadhava. Yes, I am sadhu. Yes. What is your purpose, sir? Now kindly forget all nonsense, whatever you learn. That's all. I am flattering you because I want that you forget everything, all these yogis and these and that and that and meditation. Please kick out all this. Then what I have to do? Chaitanya chanda charane Just adhere yourself to the lotus feet of Lord Chaitanya Then he becomes That's all. So I hope that all of you, men, women, boys and girls, become a spiritual master and follow this principle. Spiritual master simply, sincerely follow the principles and speak to the general public. Then Krishna immediately becomes your favorite. Krishna, Krishna does not become your favorite. You become Krishna's favorite. Krishna says in the Bhagavad Gita, 
न च तस्मात् मनुष्यु कश्चित मे प्रिय कृत्य वन हु इज डूइंग दिस हमल सर्विस ऑफ टीचिंग वॉर कृष्ण कॉन्सियस नैन नो बॉडी इज डियर एट देन हिम टू मी सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू बिकम रिकॉग्नाइज बाई कृष्ण वेरी क्विकली यू टेक आर दिस प्रोसेस ऑफ बिकमिंग स्पिरिचुअल मास्टर प्रेजेंट द भगवत गीता एज इट इज योर लाइफ इज परफेक्ट थैंक यू वेरी मच krishna kirtan gaan na tan pano prema amritam mani dhi dhira dhir jan priya priya karo nirmal sarao